Friday, it's like 1 p.m. so good afternoon. Um, our flight this morning was at 8.45 a.m. so booked a cab from my flat at like 4.40 a.m. which was in retrospect a bit too early but it's so fine. So yeah, our Airbnb is so cute. I honestly feel like I should put Airbnb Finder on my CV because the speed at which I find Airbnbs and good quality ones is unmatched. I am very proud of myself. It's giving New York. We're like right in the center of the town. Really nice location. But yeah, outfit of the day. This white fleece from Goose and Gander. Scarf is Ted Baker. And then I just got these earmuffs on Amazon. It's actually not too cold. I was under the impression it was going to be like zero degrees here, but it's like seven or eight degrees, which is even warmer than London. So, so chill. But the plan for today, I think we're going to a museum. I actually don't really know, but I do know at 6 p.m. we're going to this really cool like 360 rooftop bar with those like glass dome kind of things um so that should be fun but yeah loving this airbnb uh this kitchen area is probably my favorite bit the wooden tops the little breakfast bar so cute i feel like we should just get on with the exploring it's 1 40 now we're here for three nights today saturday sunday and then our flight is at like 6 a.m on monday back to london and then i start uni on tuesday so I feel like I'm traveling a lot. That is the plan. Some very exciting trips coming up, so stay tuned. But yeah, let's go. museum it's the museum of fine art so cool huge it reminds me of the national gallery but three times bigger and they have like an ancient egypt section as well like it's just really big we don't have time to do something else before our reservation at six at the rooftop bar igloo kind of vibe so we're just gonna chill here for a bit for maybe another like 10 15 minutes and then make a move walk back to the place it's really close to our airbnb which is good so it's like a half an hour walk from where we are right now which isn't too bad and i only came out in this but i have a t-shirt and a thermal underneath so i'm actually not too cold and then i've got my scarf the earmuffs are working wonders but yeah that's basically it successful first day so far i'm really looking forward to the place that we're about to go but yeah <laughs>
Good morning, guys. Another beautiful headwear. Yeah, changed it up. <laughs> I feel like I am really good at dressing for the winter now. Um, I'm really embracing it. <laughs> anyway, as I was saying, today is a new day in Budapest, Hungary. We got back yesterday. Ben was fighting me for like... No, I wasn't. Like you, half an hour. Yeah, he was trying you, to steal my pillow, guys. And I just wasn't having... You for like fighting me. Half an got hour. On on my he was the, trying to take was... my pillow. No, no, no. For no. half of the... No, it no, was no, 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 no. such you were stress. You are chatting rubbish. <laughs> you know. No, guys. Because this is a big debate. No. Eventually, I went... settled the debate because got on the bed, went to go to sleep, and this pillow was very comfy of mine. <laughs> Tatty put her head on her pillow. It's like, oh. And then <laughs> yanked mine under my head, <laughs> took it, <laughs> put it down. I was like, whoa. In... I'm not having no, that. No, no, no. And then... But hear me out. The pillow that was on his side was, nice. was normally my side of the bed. No. We have our designated sides of the bed. So technically speaking, <laughs> no. that was my pillow because it was on my designated pre-agreed side of the bed. No, it wasn't. So we didn't do that this time, so sucks to be you, hey? You slept though. Right now we're having a very, you know, tatty style breakfast, very bland and basic. Um, plan for today, I'm so excited. We're going to these thermal baths. Budapest is like really known for their thermal baths. I feel like that's the one thing that everyone like has to do when they come. And I feel like it's gonna be even better now that it's cold because that juxtaposition of temperature. Um, I feel like it will be even better now because of the, as I was saying, juxtaposition <laughs> of temperatures. Like it being really cold outside and really warm inside. Yeah, so there's some which are outside. We've booked one of the ones that are inside. I'll be putting up all the names and stuff on the screen of everywhere we go. But I think the one we're going to today is the Gellart Thermal Bath. But there are so many others. <laughs> You're in your own little world back there, is it? Yeah, I smell. So apparently we both found the same restaurant at the same time and we were like, oh, check out this place. <laughs> And then we look at each other's screens and it's like the place we're both already looking at. So we just booked that super quick. So we've got that tonight. I booked it for 7 p.m. But then Ben has looked at a bunch of like tourist things that we can do today. So he's kind of in charge of the whole like itinerary of it all. After much force, I must add. No, no force. I was doing it, had it under control. I've got a plan. Anyway. Just made it later than you would have done. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Thank you. Anyway, a really fun fact about Budapest. <coughs> who told me? You told me, but My who granddad. told you? Ben's granddad, shout out. Big <laughs> run. Yeah, so there's a river that runs through Budapest. Good. The river Danube. Nice. I only know that because your dad. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's like when you go into Danube. Yeah. I was like, what? <laughs> the river Danube is going through the center, and one side is called Buda, one side of the town, and then the other side of the city actually is called Pest. So put them together and it's Budapest, which is so cool, such a fun fact. Very cool. Oh, we didn't even say, yesterday, Lauren gave, Lauren again, Ben's sister. So Lauren gave us a suggestion. Well, actually, I love this story because for Ben's Christmas present, I booked this trip and um, I told Lauren before, I told Ben, obviously, and then she helped me like think of things to do. And she sent me the place um, where we went for dinner yesterday and such nice vibes. So thank you, Lauren. Went to the Hero Square, Museum of Fine Art, and then had dinner, and that was it. But we were walking around for a long time, like we were just exploring. Today's gonna be a more day of like doing things, I guess. But I'm just talking so much. <laughs> <laughs> we'll catch up in a bit. <laughs> stumbled across this building here oh my gosh i look like such a tour guide <laughs> over here we have <laughs> we're probably just gonna go inside there's like a little lookout point up here it's like really cold but really warm at the same time because of the sun but um yeah let's go check this little building out so basically um change of plans we are still gonna go but we can't go today or right now because you need to pay with cash and we don't actually have cash in yeah. hand right now we don't have any forints but, um, is that what it is? Yeah, I'm so educated. <laughs> um, but yeah, we'll catch up in a bit once we know where we're going next. Walking downtown and I'm okay. 
He's got it all figured out That's what they all say, yeah Everyone's looking at me thinking that I'm different Everyone's looking at me thinking that I'm living But I don't really care what they all say It's easier said than done Understand. What is it? This is a vanilla chai latte with oat milk from Medal. Medal Coffee Co. And I just added like the tiniest amount of sugar. So good. <laughs> so good. Promise me I won't feel dumb if I make you my number one. My friends all think that I should run like run for us, run for us, run. Like run for us, run for us, run. Gotta run, see another day. Might be fun in a month, she'll be gone away. And then it's on to the next. What did someone say? Mm -hmm. That I should run. Yeah, that's what I said. 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 Yeah, that's we're here at the Fisherman Battison. It's yes. like a nice viewpoint. Very nice. It's a nice, um, it's like a big <laughs> place. A <laughs> big place. We, we haven't been in it yet, but we're about to. Yes. Um, what's got the time? Beautiful architecture on the roof. Yeah, it looks so nice. So it's 12:48. It's so pretty. Good vibe. Really nice vibes. Um, not too busy. Probably the busiest place we've been, but it's still not even that busy. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go in. Tickets are 2,000. Depends if we got the tower. So between 2,000 and 2,200 for adults, and then it's a bit cheaper for students as well. And that's in Florence, so that's like a few pounds. Not not too expensive, yeah. to be honest. Yeah. We're on our way up the tower. It is so narrow. You have to wait for someone to come all the way down before going up because there's no space. It's like 3.45. See, I feel like I'm talking really loudly. Um, some, some hanging art back there, but such a nice gallery. The stuff was really cool. They had like abstract stuff as well as really old stuff, as well as some new modern stuff. Really good. But yeah, we're gonna go to the baths in a sec. I'm so excited. Okay. <laughs> so excited. <laughs> Good morning. 
Um, it is currently 9.15. I told Ben be ready by 9.15. He's still going to show on, but it's ready for the so show. fine, so fine. We are about to leave for our final day here. Well, we leave tomorrow morning. Like our flight is in the morning at like 6 a.m., but we've got a full day, jam-packed. Best believe I'm going back to Medal. <laughs> that coffee shop. I know what that is. <laughs> it's the coffee shop where I got um, the vanilla oat milk chai latte. It was the best chai latte I've ever had in my life. I couldn't even explain to you what made it so good, but it was good, right? Yeah, it was actually I gave some for Ben to try it and Reluctantly. he loved it. I she don't want me to have any. <laughs> Because it was so good, I needed to treasure every <laughs> single sip. No, but I will be going back there. We're going to go to like a 3D gallery, like a bunch of things today. So I'm super excited. Yesterday was good. Really liked the Fisherman's Bassetton. It was like a nice viewpoint. We always just go to viewpoints. That's like our thing. The thermal baths were cool too. Um, but yeah, we're going to go out right now. Enjoy. Drop our luggage off at the luggage drop off place, which is next door. <laughs> It's like one of these like locker places. One euro for one hour or 10 euros for the whole day. What a bargain. So we're gonna go do that now and then make our way and enjoy the day. Oh, we also need to check out of this Airbnb. Oh, this beautiful shame. Airbnb. But we're checking into another one tonight that's closer to the airport because the city center is like a half an hour drive from the airport and obviously our flight's at 6 a.m. So we probably need to be at the airport at like 6, 5, 3, like four-ish. So yeah, <laughs> let's go. <laughs> No one is even here to like assist you. It's all automated. A light work. Such light work. I've got my little tote bag. Um, Ben's got nothing because he just puts everything he needs in my bag. No, in my pockets. Anyway. I need wallet, phone, pockets. But yeah, so we're gonna go and continue exploring now. Promise me I won't fail. If I make you my number one, my friends all think that I should run like run for us, run for us. Gotta run, see another day. <laughs> Might be fun in a month, she'll be gone away. And then it's on to the next. What did someone say? That I should run away. We just went to the 3D museum, 3D gallery, right there. So funny. She just a bunch of like art, but when you stand in front of it and take pictures, it looks 3D. And it was such a fun experience. I highly recommend. Really good price. Nice vibes. Easily really just nice people. Such nice people. You can just spend like an hour, 45 minutes there. They help you take pictures, print out two free pictures along with your ticket. And they send you the rest of airdrop. Yeah, airdrop email. So good. Um, but right now we're gonna try go to the place where we tried to go yesterday, the lookout point. So yeah, that's basically it for now. It's like 12 something. The place we had breakfast was really cute. Traditional like Hungarian food, which is really nice. But yeah, we'll catch up in a bit. Missing
she don't pick up I'm stealing her heart, we could call it a stick up I'm not used to love, don't know the first thing about it But when I'm off the drugs, I feel I can't live without it So many rainy days, it feels like I'm mentally clouded In a purple haze, marijuana surrounded Such a quick trip, but I feel like we managed to squeeze in so much in the time, so I'm so happy. Like, I'm loving these two night, three night trips. I'm definitely gonna be doing more. I already have two more booked for the end of February and for March, so look out for some more travel vlogs coming so soon. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what you thought in the comments. Let me know where you think I'm going next. If you've been following me on Instagram, I did a Q&A recently where I spoke about where I'm going next. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions about anything to do with the trip, definitely let me know in the comments down below and I'll do my best to answer any of those questions. All my social media links will be in the description below, so feel free to follow me. So yeah, I'm gonna go now. I'll see you next time. So bye.